my my dear friend Drew Holiday. I hope that you can sense the uh, <laughs> the sadness. <laughs> The sadness in my voice. <laughs> there was a sense that this was coming, but still, it's, yeah. it sucks. I know. There was a sense. I think in the back of your mind, you're always like, oh, there's a good chance that it, you know we're in training camp together, and yeah. we'll see how it happens. Uh, but yeah, you know, I kind of got, got the sense a couple weeks ago. Um, and then, you know, of course, the, the story broke that uh, the, there was going to be a trade possibility uh drew from new orleans and it ended up happening and uh you know i think for him it, he's got a great chance to to win a championship uh and a great chance to at the very least win the east and and play in the finals which is important to him and for us uh you know we get uh we get bledsoe and george hill and a bunch of picks um I think both teams, if you look at it, uh, won that trade. And, and, and Griff has done a great job in uh, accumulating first-round picks, both in the, in the Drew trade and the Anthony, Anthony Davis trade. And the, look, we're, we're set up for, for long-term success with the Pelicans. That Milwaukee defense is going to be uh, tough, to put it mildly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was already pretty good. It was yeah. already pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think, um, I was I was wondering this about just this week. I mean, you know, we're taping this on Tuesday. We're putting it out today. The draft is tomorrow night. You know, we've talked about this with a few people. I think we talked about it with Fred a little bit. But the NBA, for I mean, everything about this year is different and special. But the amount of ac- activity that's going to happen over the next two weeks is completely unprecedented. Is there a part of this you think with a bunch of players where you're almost like? like wake me up when it's done or if it affects me, like you almost can't pay attention to everything that's happening because it's everything is happening so quickly. Yeah, no, I, that's, that's a great point. And I actually thought about that as we were getting ready to record this podcast <laughs> because I'm, I'm, I literally, I, I worked out, I did my two workouts before we're recording this podcast. I'm at the NBPA, uh, today. Um, so I did my core workout. I did my weight room workout, and I'm like, I'm on like Twitter, and you know, getting calls from my agent and seeing text messages from people around the league, and I'm like, this is distracting. I I, I don't like this. This is normally happening around July 1st, or it's happening around the trade deadline, uh, and it's all now crammed into one week, and it's in the middle of training, and and obviously I've got to leave here in 13 days, so I'm trying to spend as much time as I can with my family when they're not in school and, and we're all buckling up for, you know, potentially a, another shutdown. So it's, it's, it's a lot going on right now. There, there's a lot going on. 